Now, silver's up more than 50% this year, but getting slammed today on pace for its worst day since March. Wondering if that rally is starting to lose some steam. Jim Urio of TJM Services and Brian Stutland of Equity Armor Investments have some ideas for us. Brian Stutland, you begin. We talked yesterday uh, as to whether gold was topping out, maybe silver's topping out. What do you think? Well, I think if you look at some of the technicals here, look, in the middle of July, we got word that maybe a second stimulus package was coming, and then you really saw silver take off to the upside. It's still in this channel. I mean, when things get really volatile near tops like this after a big run, it gets scary. And, and believe me, it could be a sign that we're starting to sell off. But we're at the lower end of the channel. I think I would still be a buyer right here. 2665 is really that lower end point. So I think it makes a nice entry level to get in here, keep a tight stop at that 2665 level, and hopefully continue to ride the tram channel upwards. But if we break the channel, look out below. All right, Jim Urio, what do you think? Um, well, fundamentally, the story hasn't changed much at all. It's still 98% of what it was before. Yes, there's a tiny bit of optimism today when we start talking about a vaccine and things like that. So people, the profit takers jump in, and then all of a sudden, when something has had such enthusiasm, like you said, a 50% rally over the year, when, and, and there's, there's so many people who are looking for a spot to get out, they head for the exits quickly. If you have to look for one fundamental thing that's maybe changed a little, is that up until a few days ago, the dollar had been somewhat cascading lower, and it seems to have stabilized. Even though it's a little weaker today, the market, the silver market goes up when we think the dollar move lower is out of control. And now it's moving within the range, so I think it's fine. I actually bought a call spread today. I think it could trade all the way back down to 25, and I may buy some more there. Good stuff. Gentlemen, thank you. Jim Urio, Brian Stutland.